Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. Today's video I'll be reviewing an upgrade kit. This is 115 or 115 workshop YYW11 upgrade kit for Earthrise Double Dealer. Now this kit does a couple of things, mainly fixes the height issue. Well, some people it's not an issue, but for me it was an issue. But mainly fixes the height issue of Earthrise Double Dealer. One thing I did in the past to give him that extra height was add these uh, old combiner war feet on the bottom of him give him that extra height but uh, this should fix that and another thing this kit fixes is the hollowness of the front in vehicle mode so let's open it up here this comes in this little ziploc bag and we get several pieces here these are extensions for the legs not sure where this piece goes but uh, we'll find out soon and the panels yet these panels you can see these are I think 3d printed and then spray painted to color match yeah, these other panels here as well now as far as the color matching goes Hopefully it comes out on camera. It is very close. Very, very close. This in, to my naked eye is a little bit darker in tone, but just looking at it on the screen, it looks almost exactly alike. I'll put links to where I bought this kit in the description below. Okay, let's get this kit installed. So this piece is basically for a double dealer's gun just allows it to sit a little bit further back instead of all the way in the front here so the unmodified gun sticks in all the way up here in the front this will allow it to go a bit further back like so and this just pegs in nice snug fit and double dealer can hold his gun further back Looks pretty cool. Like it. Now the most difficult part of the installation will require some disassembly. There's some screws here on the back that I'm going to remove to take apart the legs. So basically there's three screws on each leg. One here, one here, and one here. Oh, you got the legs removed here. So basically we're going to remove this black piece and replace it with this one. If you bend at the knee back here, like so, it'll allow it to pop out. There you go. Put that aside. Next we're going to put this piece. So you have these two pieces. You want the two slots to face on the inside and the single slot to face on the outside and pop it right back in and you can see it pops right in like so there you go and do the other side now with that in we can reassemble the legs I got everything nice and tight. Already can see a much better visual improvement here. Last but not least, we have to put on the panels. Now with the legs assembled, we can attach the filler panels that go in this gap here. Now they are basically fillers that you uh, attach on uh, in robot mode and then when you transform it into vehicle mode, you do pop them off and reattach them in vehicle mode so you do have some parts forming there now according to the instructions you basically tab this piece into here now it's a very snug fit and you will chip the paint when you attach it on because it is very snug but it is supposed to go into this slot here and in here but i can't get it in but yeah you can see i've already chipped the paint on that so i'm just going to leave it out in robot mode and you basically can just 
tab it into these slots here and in here to have the covers. There you go. Let's put on the other side. And there you have the gap fillers for the legs. A little disappointing that this part doesn't peg in right out of the box. I do think if I file it a bit more, it should work. And even though if I file it and the paint does strip off, it doesn't show in vehicle mode because this actually comes together in vehicle mode. So I guess that'll be fine. Okay, let's get Double Dealer transformed so we can check out the kit in vehicle mode. And here's Double Dealer in vehicle mode. And the filler for the front here is mainly done through parts forming. So you do take out the panels that were on the legs in robot mode and reattach them here in the front. So you take this panel here and tab it into these slots here. Like so, and then fold this in to the other side. And then we can attach this on to double dealer through this little slot here. And here's Double Dealer with the upgrade kit in vehicle mode. Looks very good. I mean, it does the job, but I think the kit shines in robot mode more. Um, it is parts forming, so if that's not something you like, then this upgrade kit might not be for you. But uh, for me, I am okay with it. Anyway, that is it for this video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And thanks for watching.